Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I am trying out the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Stunna Lip Paint in the shade Uncensored, which is the universal red shade. And I was really excited to get this in my December 2022 Boxy Lux box because I love trying out Fenty Beauty products. And I have tried out the Stunna Lip Paint in the Hot Pink shade before, and I love it. So I'm really excited to be expanding my collection in the shades of this Stunna Lip Paint Longwear Fluid Lip Color. So this retails for $26. And by the way, if you haven't seen my Boxy Luxe unboxing, I have that up here on my YouTube channel. And it's a pretty great box. And that's the quarterly upgrade. So let's go ahead and get into this beautiful red shade. Such a great holiday shade. And I love the packaging on this. It reminds me of nail polish, which speaking of nail polish, you kind of have to treat it like a nail polish by shaking it up before applying it. But so my lips, no surprise, are very chapped right now. This cold, dry weather is not fun for me. <laughs> but so let's go ahead and first check out the applicator because this does have a very unique applicator. It's almost like an hourglass shape. And before I go ahead and apply this to my lips, I definitely need to swatch it. Oh my gosh. It is so intensely pigmented. I mean, it's literally called lip paint and it seriously is like paint. Oh, such a bold, intense <laughs> color here, especially with how pigmented it is, but I'm gonna go for it, of course. Yeah, and it has like no fragrance to it. No real smell, I'd say. And okay, I'm gonna try and be as precise as possible, but with red lipsticks, I typically like to go in with a red lip liner just to be extra precise because it's so obvious if I mess up the outline. But let's see how I do. I mean, the applicator makes it pretty easy to get some crisp edges. And since the product is so pigmented, you really only need the lightest touch and just one swipe and you've got that full opaque color. Oh, it seriously is such a gorgeous shade of red. It's dark, but not too dark. And oh my gosh, it's like, yeah, such a neutral, like not too orange, not too blue. Like you would not even know that I have chapped lips under this because it, it seriously looks like that like liquid latex kind of effect on the lips. Like it is not clinging to the dry patches at all. It's dried down but it has almost a little bit of shine to it as well. Like it's, I guess I would say it's a matte liquid lipstick, but it's not a dry matte finish at all. Such even opaque color. So let's see if there's transfer. That is some transfer. Maybe it wasn't completely dried down because I don't think that this usually has transfer. Let's see. Yeah. I'm still getting a bit of transfer there, but you can't even tell it all on the lips. It's still 100% intact. So maybe it just takes a while to dry down, but even still, that is super long lasting and I'm okay with a little bit of transfer since it's still beautifully intact. So if I am to go out of my comfort zone and wear a red lipstick, this truly is one that I would use because it's long lasting. It is the most perfect flattering red shade. It makes your teeth look white. It just is such a perfect red shade and it's comfortable on the lips. It's not clinging to dry patches. Everything about this is beautiful. It might be a good new year's resolution for me to wear 
a little bit more bolder lip products because I just am often not bothering to wear lipstick on a daily basis because I don't want to have to retouch it and have it come off throughout eating and drinking, but I love the look of it and I feel like the more I wear it, the more comfortable I'll be in it. So I'd like to challenge myself to do that some more and wear this more often. I really do love this formula. It is kind of pricey, but this will be able to last for so long since you really just need one swipe and you are good to go full opaque color. So if you've tried this out before, let me know in the comments down below what you think of it. And if you've tried it out in any of those other shades, let me know in the comments down below what you think of those other colors. And thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day and I will see you tomorrow in my next video.